Nina. Oh, no, sir. Nina Mikhailovna Zarechnaya. And your age? My age? Yes, please. That means, how old are you? <laughs> how old are you looking for, sir? <laughs> Answer that question. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, you, you see, it's it's just that I can play any age. I can be 16 or 30. Uh, in school, I played a 78-year-old woman with rheumatism, and everyone said it was very believable. A 79-year-old rheumatic woman told me so herself. <laughs> <laughs> That's very impressive. But we are not looking for a 79-year-old rheumatic woman. We are looking for a 22-year-old actress. Now, how old are you, please? 22, sir. <laughs> Yes, sir. I would have said rather 27, 28. Oh, oh well, that's because I have a bad head cold, sir, and it makes me look older. I, I, last year when I had influenza, the doctor thought I was 39, but I, I promise I can look 22 when you need it, sir. Where we have nothing to offer you but our company and the country food we eat ourselves. It's wonderful to be in the middle of a family again. Mr. Meredith, what does it mean to brush off? Well, you'd better ask your Aunt Nadia about that. Uh, this food is wonderful. Who cooked all these delicious things? Who else would cook for you but Nadia? Did you cook this dinner? I did. But you're a pianist. How can you let her do such work? How can I let her? The question is, how can I stop her? <laughs> I would not be happy here on the farm if I did not do my share of the work. No, but is it necessary that you drive a tractor? It is a privilege to drive the tractor. Our tractor, my Galupchik, is a beauty. Wait till I show it to you. Oh, some board that you picked up after three belts of booze. This is your great one to romance, isn't it? Your last roar of passion before you settle into your emeritus years. Is that what's left for me? Is that my share? She gets the winter passion and I get the dotage? What am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to sit home knitting and purling while you slink back like some penitent drunk? I'm your wife, damn it! And if you can't work up a winter passion for me, the least I require is respect and allegiance.